Hello everyone and welcome back to another week of the DeWitt Drawing Review. I spent some time with just one drawing this week and I'll introduce you to my abstract series, which is some pencil drawings about stuff. A couple of years ago, there was an art exhibit that was on tour across the United States and I'm sure the world. It was Guillermo del Toro's At Home with Monsters. It was his own personal collection of absolutely mind-blowing art, generally in the macabre, monstery vein that Guillermo del Toro is so good at. The work in that exhibit was, besides being extremely gorgeous, uh, it was also a lot of it very odd and strange. And seeing it in the setting of a major museum surrounded you know, by all of these other works, it put this, I don't know what to call it, this impulse I have to draw weird and odd things. It made me take that desire seriously. So I came home that day and I started drawing these more elaborate pencil drawings and I haven't stopped. The first couple were faces similar to what I was doing in my portrait series but more fully realized you know uh, like these drawings they were very fleshed out and sculpted and uh, put in a lot of time and the blending of certain things. And since I was doing weird faces in my portrait series I thought I'd just drop that idea and again go to this place of drawing from nothing and just start moving my pencil and make some scribbles and then erase some of it and then draw some more and smear it around and erase some of it and scribble around and just do that over and over until I start seeing something and then I do what you see me doing right now um, picking some darker areas and then it's just a matter of kind of sculpting it carving it into the paper um, and once I find that the lightest space then I'm just carving carving deeper and deeper and uh, I get lost in these drawings. I have so much fun. Something I haven't done but I should do next time is time how long it takes me for, to do these. Um, like obviously this is the longest drawing I've done for this show and I don't know how long it took total because I did these in little pieces throughout the course of a week. So uh, maybe ballpark it took me six solid hours of drawing. Uh, I'm not sure. I'll time it next time. They're most often kind of look like organs or guts or just strange alien type things. Uh, kind of similar to what H.R. Geiger did in, with his alien uh, creation and all of his artwork. And I'm going to tell a quick story about going to H.R. Geiger's house. Uh, two friends of mine, both artists from Kentucky, Gerald Tidwell and Justin Kammerer, aka Angry Blue, we were three were part of a show that was in Zurich, Switzerland years ago called Rockaholics. And the guy who was putting on the show knew a guy who knew where H.R. Geiger lived in Zurich. And we were all there and uh, yes, of course we would like to go <laughs> visit his house. Um, so we drive through Zurich, you know, it's absolutely one of the more breathtaking countries you can drive through. And we get to his house and we there's nobody home. We did knock on the door, but because there was no one home, we just kind of looked around in his garden for a while. And he had this crazy throne set up that I would not sit in but Gerald and Justin did. Um, there was a little, he had a cat, there was a cat door, we peeked into his kitchen. Um, we were stalking him, I guess, uh, but it was a lot of fun. A uh, quick word on the pencils I'm using. It is a 6B, a 3B, and an HB pencil, and then a kneaded eraser and a black vinyl eraser. I'm also using a semi-rough paper just because I like that extra texture that pencil gives to paper when it's rough, not totally smooth. I like that graininess. Let the materials be the materials. Thank you all for watching this week's episode of the DeWitt Drawing Review. See you next time and happy drawing.